Girl, good morning. Had to come back inside and get Max's lunchbox because I swear, I swear before everything that is holy and Gouda cheese that he would forget to breathe if it wasn't for me. Let's take these churns to school. Maximus. Yeah. My lips are stained from last night. Did you forget something? No. My lunchbox. Oh. <laughs> Put your drink inside. Oh. oh. All right. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. All right, all right. Okay. I'm not driving the school bus. Oh. We though it feels like it. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning today. How are you? Now y'all already know it ain't the morning time. I'm trying to get my life together. Good morning. Do you hear the birds chirping? No? Okay. Good morning. Good morning today. How are you? And my camera don't want to stay steady because I got it so rigged on my um tripod and I'm holding it. It's shaking like a 3D movie. And yes. I feel like you guys are staring deep into my eyebrow soul. You didn't know eyebrows had souls. I was in the process. See, I get very like distracted. First, I was doing my eyebrows cause I'm like, yes, I'm about to put on a layer of clothing on top of my face. And then I was like, oh my God, my bathroom is a mess. So I come out of my bathroom to go get some cleaning supplies. And I'm like, oh my God, my bedroom is a mess. And I'm like, oh, I need to clean my bed. Cause you know, that was one of my new year's resolutions. Make your bed to form a habit. So I'm making my bed every day. And then I started cleaning. And then I said, you know what? I haven't even picked up my camera today. I need to say hello to my best friends. Hey, best friends, how you doing? So maybe I should go finish my face, but I don't even feel like finishing my face. Cause I just feel like I'm losing inspiration. Oh, I feel like this could be, this could be very, very dramatic. Cue the music. I feel like I'm getting bored of makeup. I don't feel like it's bringing me any more joy. I just feel like it's holding me back in life. Every time I got to go somewhere to the store on a job interview, they want to see your face made up. Did she say job interview? I just feel like the world wants too much of me. The world wants too much of me. And I can't take it anymore. If I want to walk out the door with no makeup on my face. People will say she looks like Eeyore. The world wants too much of me and I can't take it anymore. I just don't want to wear makeup. I want to be like Alicia Keys. But then she got a husband named Swiss Beats and two kids. And I'm just the, yeah, okay. Mommy. Mommy is not here. Go Mommy. eat your food. I just made you a lunch. You guys act like y'all was so hungry that you were just going to croak over and your stomach was going to eat itself, you know, and just leave you for dead. And now you're not even sitting at the table eating your food. Why? Why? I'll tell you why. Because kids don't care. Kids don't Hi. care. Hi. 
Ah. They will make their mama feel like the mama is a bad mama because they so hungry. Hungry mommy, hungry mommy, hungry. Then you put food in front of their face because they're starving children in the Hi. world and don't nobody eat nothing. They just Hi. look at the plate. Like the plate gonna eat itself. What you gotta say for yourself, ma'am? Hi. Hi. And I'm really tired of my house looking like I have kids. I'm tired of it. You you shaking your head too? You tired of a tired of house looking like we got kids? Hi. Tired of my house looking like I got kids. Jojo, come from over there. I've got to get it together today, best friends. I don't know what's going on with me. Like, I am in, like, um, you know what? Stop, Felicia. You have to find the positivity in life and in this day. And God has provided another day and another wig. Yes. And a fresh face of Maybelline. Even though I said I wasn't going to put on no makeup today, I lied. Izzy, look. Can you? Can you get out of the camera? You want to come to the camera? Go eat some food. And then you can talk to the camera. So I'm going to guzzle this water down. Because I said I'm going to be drinking more water. I got to go pick up the boys. I don't know where my day goes, y'all. I don't know. I feel like... It's my emails. Like when I when when I get home hey. from t dropping the boys off at school um, in the morning time, I get back home with the twins. Automatically, somebody's got a boo boo or pee pee or whatever. But then I spend time checking my my business emails. Jojo, we gotta do your hair. We're gonna untwist your hair. No. Yeah, cause you had these twists yesterday. No. Yeah, you got to look like a well-kept child. Like mommy. Don't be looking unkept around here, looking like the bottom of a broom. Do you know what the bottom of a broom looks like? Awful. Awful. You said it. Awful. Let's get JoJo's hair life together. How about that? Ouch. That don't hurt. I'm going to treat you like they treat that little girl in the color purple. Stop that crying. Ouch. That hurt? Okay, mommy be gentle. I be gentle. Does that hurt? Okay. It doesn't hurt. Why? Because it doesn't. Because you're just making it up. Get up, Joe. Come on. See, the struggle is real. Dear God in heaven, what is happening to my life right now? Y'all, I'm running after the twins, and I'm like, dog, why does it feel weird? Why can't I run? I still got my house slippers on. Jesus, be a shit, Jesus. Y'all, I can't, I can't, I just can't. So, I am feeling like a mommy. crappy mom right now. Mommy. Yes, baby. Mom. Yes. I don't think it's because I'm wearing my bedroom slippers. I just think because I feel like I have not accomplished anything that would solve any big life issues. Besides not catching MRSA, you know, because you want to keep your house clean, you don't want to catch MRSA. But you know, I don't know. Oh, there are my boys. The door's open. I had to pick up some food because we got activities to get to after school, a whole bunch of homework to do a limited amount of time. And I did not make dinner. I don't have a bunch of homework. And I didn't make dinner. So we got to get this day going. You don't have a whole bunch of homework? No, no, I can't. Yeah, but you still got to do other stuff on the, the computer skills or whatever they, they be doing, y'all. So I just decided to order something really quick so they can be ready for um, their swim lessons. Swim lessons? Not really lessons, but swim. What would I call it? They know how to swim, but like we're pushing them to go into swimming as like a, a real sport for them. Look at them, they fight and stop it. He hit me in the head. Look at Maximus. I mean, Izzy. I got too many kids, I mix all their names up. Izzy, Izzy is knocked out. And that just kicked me, and it hit me on the head. What else is new? See, you almost kicked me. So, this is Mommy. Julian's first time eating Chinese food that he can recall. Mommy. He's had it before, he just doesn't remember. Yes, I Izzy. I Chinese food. Mommy. Oh, 
Okay. And he had the chicken, sweet and sour chicken with the dip and some fried rice and some lo mein. Which one was your favorite? The noodle and the chicken. The noodle and the chicken? It's pretty good. Max, which one was your favorite? The noodle? That's like his third helping of the noodles, you guys. Izzy? Chad, Izzy just picked over like a little bird. Chirp, 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 chirp. And uh, I somehow was able to make myself a little plate, y'all. Oh, look, it's a noodle hanging. Oh, noodle. Noodle. You want noodle? I want noodle. Noodle, noodle. 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 You don't want no noodles, Izzy. No, you don't. You only want it because I'm eating it. Yeah, he still got. Noodles. Okay, baby bird, here. He still got some. Exactly. He's got. He still got oh, some. He's left over. I, like. I know. He's got a full plate left over, and I'm gonna save it for him when he gets hungry. He's gonna be like, "Mommy, I hungry." Oh yeah, I got a plate. Uh -huh. Who? Uh -huh. Oh, say excuse me. Excuse me. Uh -huh. Izzy, it's rude to have your phone at the table. No. Mm-hmm. Uh, uh, if you do have mm -hmm. your phone at the table, but you have no, your phone. No. Close your mouth. Hey, Izzy, put your phone down. No phone at that table. I'm so hungry. That don't make no, no. sense. Mm. Yep. Mm. No. And that's what the hand is. That moment when your mom is about to come over but your house is a hot bubbling pile of mess and you got to run around so she won't think you dirty or just talk cash money trash right to your face yeah we about to get this house clean let's go We did it. What, Izzy? Who? Who? What you want? What you did? What you done did? Mm -mm. When you start mumbling? Why you did that? Why you took the batteries out? Plotting. Plotting. I hear my door. It's my mama. Huh. Hold it. Oh. Yeah, Gigi's here, y'all. 
Yes, you took the batteries out. That's not right. Ready for bed? No? You ready for bed? You want to get ready for bed? No? You don't want to go to bed? No? <laughs> yes, you do. He's sleepy. Um, Where's the remote? You're sleepy. Where's the remote? Where's the remote, Izzy? Have you seen the remote so we can have a conversation with the best friends before we go to bed? No. Uh, hopefully it's not too loud, but okay. I'm about to hit the hay, you guys. Yeah. What a day. Um, started off a little weird because I wanted to complain, but I didn't. Yeah. But I only wanted to complain because I just no. felt I didn't feel motivated to do anything. And then I was watching something on YouTube when the conversation is about forced happiness um and what that means being a youtuber is sometimes we come on here and we pretend to be happy when we're not or there's this overwhelming feeling to have to be happy when you're not you know or show people the best parts of your life rather than the latter part of your life and I think it's, I think why it's good to focus on the happiness is because happiness is infectious. And I also think that just because you're having a bad day doesn't mean that it has to be the, the main focus of your day. Like you can still have a day that has quality to it even though you're having a bad day. And I think that's why a lot of people on YouTube, I guess, force the happiness and I'm okay with that because positivity goes farther than negativity goes and especially if you've ever been depressed you don't want to really feel that anymore and I know I don't want to feel um, down in the dumps anymore 2017 I declare and decree that it is and will be and already is a wonderful year for me um, on the level of just like happiness and, and being content with my happiness um but that's not to say that you know i won't have bad days but i just think i'm more inclined to share happy thoughts happy times and not you know faking it for y'all you know if i have something that's bothering me in the day i i may say it i probably will say it but not in a way that is so 
bruh, you know, making me feel like down and sad or makes you guys sad or down or whatever. I, I just really, 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 really want to have a great, wonderful year. And um, I believe that's possible. I believe that's possible. So if you guys do see me like happy or just attempting to be happy or whatever, embrace it. Embrace it. I want you to embrace your happiness today. I want you to leave a comment down below telling me what was the best part of your day or what made you smile today. You know, whether it was, it could be something very, very simple. What was happy about, Izzy don't touch that. Izzy trying to turn off the TV. And I got one of these smart TVs, y'all. Once you turn this box off, it takes like forever for it to turn back on. But what was the best part of your day? Highlight of your day? What made you smile? You know, what was it? Let me know down below. I can tell you a uh, highlight of my day was Hi. my kids or Julian trying Chinese food for the first time that he can remember. Uh, see, he can do his karate kicks. He wants to be in karate. Yeah, karate kicks. Let me see your karate kicks. Let me see your karate move. Hiya. 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 That's right. And uh, what else? And uh, and the boys, Julian and Maximus, are so hilarious. I didn't realize that they were hilarious. I mean, I did because you know that they're, they're my kids, but and they're a lot like their mom. But they're really funny. They're really funny. And I wish, I feel like I need a GoPro in the car because that's when we have some of our craziest conversations between my boys. They are just, they're funny. But yeah. Anyway, I'm going to say goodnight to you guys. Oh, will you cut it out, Izzy? I'm going to say goodnight to you guys. And then I'm going to put... No. The coffee mug up mm. with a name with a name on it, darling. Because I forgot to put it in the vlog today, but I'm just gonna uh, write a name on the mug. Uh -huh. Give you a shout out here. All right. I love uh -huh. you guys. And if you want your name on the coffee mug, make sure that you're subscribed and you hashtag coffee uh -huh. mug after whatever uh -huh. comment you leave. I love y'all. I gotta go put this guy to bed because she wants to play. Oh my gosh! We should do the no hands challenge, Izzy. No hands. <laughs> Come here, say goodnight. Say goodnight. So everybody do the karate back up. Back up. Okay, ready? Go. Yeah. 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 Now kick, Izzy. Yeah. 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 Awesome. Now jump and kick. Yeah. Woo. You're gonna be a black belt in no time, dude. I like that. <laughs>